Good day, my beloved uh, followers and subscribers. Please, let's see what we can do with this question. Let's scratch this question. It's very simple. It's coming out from sort uh, solution. We have that roots 200 minus roots 50. Time is all. So yeah, try it before you, you can pause the video and try it. Then continue. Let's see. What do we do? Remember, for 200, you are, you are going to find two numbers. And one of the numbers must be a pivot square, and the other one must not be a pivot square. So that when you multiply, you have 200. The same thing with 50, you are going to find two numbers. And one of the numbers must be a pivot square. So that when you multiply these two numbers, you have what? 50. For 200, I say um, 100 multiplied by 2. 100 is the perfect square, 2 is, is not. So when you multiply these two together, you are going to have a 200. We move again to this guy, 50. If I say um, 25 times 2, 25 times 2. Okay, 25 times 2. 25 is the perfect square, 2 is not. So if I multiply these two, I'm going to have what, 50. Let's go. We can spread this uh, square into, we have a um, root 100. Multiply by 2 minus root 25 multiplied by root 2. What is the square root of 100? That is 10. Root 2 minus. What is the square root of 25? That is 5. Root 2. So look at this. There is what we call um similar sort. Whenever you have a similar sort, you can do what? Subtract or add it. So in this case, since it is subtraction, we are going to subtract. So 10 minus 5 is going to give us 5. We now attach the root 2. So this is the answer to this uh, very question. It is very, very simple. I hope you learned something today. Please don't forget to share. Bye-bye.